If you're here because you want to stop mumbling, good, you're in the right place. No messing about, no intros, here's how you do it. It's going to take practice, but do these exercises every day and I assure you, your mumbling will stop. And if you continue to do them, along with subscribing to my channel so you can watch other videos, you'll progress and your whole voice will become a much better instrument for you. Great, but where do we start? Firstly, if you're a mumbler, it's quite possible that you haven't been using your jaw properly, and that can often be due to tension. We carry a lot of tension in our jaws and we don't ever think to massage them. So the first thing we're going to do is start relaxing these muscles. At first, it can hurt, don't be put off by that, but don't go too hard either. This is gonna take a couple of weeks before you really, really get the benefit from it and you start limbering up the jaw so it starts relaxing and working for you better. Take your palms and pull them down uh, from the top of your cheekbone over the muscle in between your jaw down to your bottom of the jaw. And you can feel the tender spot in the middle somewhere. There. <sighs> oh. Like any massage, just do it as much as is comfortable. Secondly, now we're gonna really get into that muscle. If you can get a table, put your elbows there, take your thumbs, stick them into that muscle so you're going from a different angle rather than going down. Now you're pushing in and lean the weight of your head onto your thumbs. This one can really hurt. So don't do it for too long, but do it regularly. If you can do it twice a day, you'll start to see the benefit. Once a day is great, twice is better, thrice is crazy, but crazy is good, okay? Next, take the knuckle of your little finger, put it in between your teeth, like so, and you're gonna practice yawning, but without opening your teeth, like this. <sighs> Try and move all the muscles in your face. Try and widen your eyes and widen your ears, pull everything back, but keep your teeth just gently locked onto your finger. So everything on the inside is opening up and creating space. And if you're mumbling, a lot of this has kind of closed down and not being used so well. So we need to open up that space. So we're relaxing the jaw, we're opening up the spaces in the back of our mouth and our throats. Once you've done the yawning, I want you to try and say this line whilst yawning. The line is Ken Dodds, Dad's Dog's Dead. And I want you to say every word clearly right until the end. Ken Dodds, Dad's Dog's Dead. But with your finger in your mouth and whilst you're yawning. Ken Dodds, Dad's Dog's Dead. Ken Dodds, Dad's Dog's Dead. Ken Dodds, Dad's Dog's Dead. Now you can do this 10, 20 times, once, twice, thrice a day, however much you can is better. If you feel anything hurting or it goes a bit too much, then pull away, have a little rest, come back to it another time. Don't worry, don't push yourself, don't be so hard on yourself. We're here to stop mumbling, not to train for the military, all right? So a quick recap, use your palms to pull down over the muscles in your jaw, use your thumbs to go into that muscle and really give it a good massage. Practice yawning with your finger in your mouth. <gasps> And practice saying Ken Dodds Dad's Dog's Dead with your finger in your mouth while you're trying to yawn at the same time. Ken Dodds Dad's Dog's Dead. These are gonna really help you. You should hear a difference straight away after doing these, but after two weeks, it's really gonna work for you. And of course, if you subscribe and hit the notifications bell, you'll never miss a video. And you can stay up to date with new exercises, tips, and tricks. I've been Darren, this is How to Stop Mumbling and Improve Your Voice. See you next time.